Hey, hello there, guys. Proxens here, and welcome back to another episode of the Yokai Watch 3 Sukiyaki version series on the channel. So, in the previous episode, we did one more of the key quests, or we might have done two if I'm not mistaken. Anyways, we did key quests, and now we have to finish the final key quest by going over here. And I'm going to select it real quick so we know where to go. There we go, and now if we just follow the arrow, we'll find the key quest, which appears to be inside the Yapple store. That's an interesting location for this. Somewhat unexpected, but interesting. So, hello there, how can we help out? I'm guessing this is going to be another one of the missions where we just have to fight opponents and that's the extent of what you actually do in the mission so let's see here alright here we go I'm going to get started by using Dodzilla's salt mitt since that is something we've been doing in most of these fights where we have to take on these opponents and it helps save time okay there we go how's their health looking Okay, not bad, not bad. Let me use a pizza real quick. Oh no, Dodzilla's down. This is bad. Um, I have this medicine that I can use. It'll come in handy. Let me do a quick switch there. We only have two of them left, so I don't think it's absolutely necessary to use the blaster. It's certainly an option, and it's certainly a good option, but... I don't think it's absolutely necessary since I assume we're going to go into another one of these fights shortly. So I kind of want to save the blaster for the next fight so then we can get a nice chunk of damage done at the start of the next fight and that really saves time. So let's see here. Okay, looks like we're good to go with this. And is that it? You shouldn't be celebrating so early because now we have a new opponent to face. Okay, it looks like we have to face three of these guys. Hopefully it's not all three. Hopefully it's just one. Let's see. Okay, it's all three. Wonderful. You know, I'm kind of glad that I did what I did and saved the blaster. <laughs> Because the blaster is going to be very useful in this fight here. Okay, get high damage. Nah, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Darn it. Darn it. It's okay though, because we can still do a good chunk of damage with the blaster in this form. In the regular damage form, I mean. So, let's see here. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Okay, let me bring you into the fight, and then I'll use this Sultimate, because it looks like they're not going to move, so that's good for us. Here we go, charging that up, and use it. Come on. There you go. How much damage are you going to do? You're going to do... Enough to take all three of them down at once. Wow. Wow, okay. Okay, then. <laughs> I was not expecting that to happen, but all three of them were taken down at once. That's kind of wild. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. So, is that it for the quest, or do we have some more opponents to face? It looks like there's no more opponents showing up, so I'm going to take a guess and say that we're good to go. And, of course, we do have to celebrate a little bit, because that was a pretty easy quest. That was a pretty easy key quest there. And the fact that somehow, someway, Kung Fu Mac managed to take all three of those yokai down at once just makes the quest even better. So, let's see here. What can we get? What can we get? We got some medicine. Awesome. We used one in the fight, and then we got one after the fight. Truly spectacular. Okay. So now that we have completed all of the key quests, I believe... 
I think we need to go over to the boss room. Hmm. I think so. I'm not sure. There might be something we have to do before it, but I'm pretty sure that we do have to go to the boss room. So let's see where the arrow is taking us. And from the looks of it, it is directing us towards the boss room. But we are unable to... Oh, never mind. It's not taking us to the boss room. This is the boss room right here. We can't go inside yet. We have to do some other stuff before we can. Ah, oh, dang it. I should have pressed the A button there. Because the door to enter was right there. But I walked a little bit too far. And now we're in an unnecessary fight. Wonderful. Okay. Dodzilla's going down, so let me just swap out. There we go. There wasn't much else I could really do there. Okay. Come on, take them down. They barely have any health left. Let me do this. They should be insanely easy to take down at this point. I mean, let's look at their health. That one over there to the far left doesn't have anything. The one on the right doesn't have much. The middle one has more than the rest. Also, the one on the left is gone now. There we go. There we go. So let me do a quick swap in with you. Okay, come on. Come on, you gotta be kidding me. There you go. You took that one down. And now if you don't take this one down shortly, then I will be very disappointed. There you go. Alright, we need to heal up at some point because we definitely need that. I'll try to be careful to continue avoiding as many of those fights as I possibly can, since those fights are absolutely unnecessary. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? They're in the base? You have gotta be joking. You have really gotta be joking. I'm not ready for this. None of my yokai have health. Okay, let's see here. It's pizza time. Let's use this pizza on Dodzilla. Let me check something with the blaster real quick. How are the metals moving? Hmm. I think I can do something here. Pretty sure I can. Okay. Let's see here. I'm trying to go as fast as I possibly can with this. There we go. Obviously, if we had gone with the other one, we probably could have done more damage, but I have a strategy. I have a strategy whenever we use a Charming Tribe Yokai, where I use the stylus to guide the marker, and then I just spam the L button as fast as I possibly can, and usually it does stuff. Sometimes it works better, sometimes it doesn't work so well because the metal will be moving very fast. It just depends on the situation. <laughs> Let me use a pizza. Never mind. Never mind. We did not have time to use a pizza there. That's disappointing. Please don't toss me into another fight. Please don't. Are we good? Okay, we're good. Phew. That was close. Because... You know, that was close to being a bad situation, because if we had been tossed into another fight, it would have been impossible to succeed in, unless we absolutely positively tried really, really weird tactics. Then it might have worked. Anyways, it looks like Fubuki-chan has cleared out the area here, so that's cool. And she's gone. Well, no, she just went over there, and now she's on her phone. <laughs> okay. Very well, then. <laughs> so, what's our next course of action? I think now, after we've cleared out the HQ of those evil grunt yokai, I am pretty sure that we need to go to the boss room. 
Oh, this is KJ uh, Komajiro, but it's his DJ form. <laughs> That's cool. That's pretty cool. So, is he here to warn us about the boss, or is he just here to reminisce and stuff? I can't tell. And now, oh, he's back to normal. Okay. So this is Komajiro in normal Komajiro form. So that's pretty cool. I'm not going to give a nickname to Komajiro, because I can remember Komajiro's name. You know. It's pretty easy to remember. <laughs> okay, so that's cool. Now that we have Komajiro on the team, well, now that we have Komajiro's medal, because I don't think I can implement Komajiro onto the team since we have a bunch of S ranks and I can't really replace those. <laughs> well, I can, but I don't really want to because it would be a bad idea. <laughs> Anyways, let's run over here. Oh, hello. Do I have to fight you to get in? Is that what's up? Just let us inside. There's not much you can do. I've already fought like 20 of these grunts. Oh my gosh. Uh, this kind of sucks. I probably should have tried to heal up, but I didn't. Let me use a pizza real quick. Here we go. Use this pizza on Dodzilla. <laughs> Okay, cool. Let me start using his Sultimate in the meantime, while we wait for the Blaster to activate. And then when the Blaster activates, I will use the Blaster, so we can do a good chunk of damage. Unless we manage to take them all down before then, which I kind of doubt, given the fact that the Blaster is two bars away from being full. We might take one down. Or not. Okay. Let's just use the blaster. Here we go. Please tell me the metals aren't moving too fast. Yeah, that's a bit too fast. Okay, let me do this. There we go. See, there's a certain speed where I can use the charming blaster mode but otherwise I need to switch to the slippery mode just because the slippery mode has auto aim so you know that's kind of useful okay come on can we get another one down is that possible oh come on it's so close it's so close to going down one more hit you've got this You've got this. One more hit. There you go. Come on. Come on. Get one more hit on that guy. Not an Inspirit. We don't need Inspiriting. We need damage. There you go. There you go. We did it. We did it. Surprisingly. Since we really weren't in the best position to try and go into that fight. But we did it anyways. And we successfully went through that battle and now I'm going to enter this area just to be slightly disappointed by the fact that we can't actually go to the boss since we don't have what we need oh no please don't attack me don't try me you can walk around all you want but don't attack me okay see this is what I meant we're going to be slightly disappointed since we do not have what we need to enter so in order to enter we need to go over to Yapol, I believe so let's find a Mirapo is this a Mirapo nope that is most definitely not a Mirapo I'm pretty sure there's only one Mirapo in New Yoma so that's a bit disappointing and there's only one currently there is one more that we get later on, but it'll be a while until we get to that point. Anyways, we need to go over over to Yopple. <laughs> oh man, okay. We're going over to Yopple. There we go, set it properly. And now, I think we need to talk to this person? Is this the correct thing to do? Yes it is! 
Very nice. So this will get the A rank watch quest started. And I accidentally said no to having markers show up. Let me change that since I kind of really need those markers. So here we go. Say yes. And now... What do we need to do? Oh, here's the checklist. Okay, thank you. So we have to follow the checklist, and once we do everything on the checklist, we'll be able to get the rank A watch. But for now, I'm going to end off this episode here, so thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. And as always, I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody.